Hello everyone, welcome back. I am Bogmod. We've uh we helped out. Our, our good dear friend uh Cucker Artois. There's Artois. Artois. There's Artois. And that would make it viable addition to our nation. Uh Brandenburg remains the Emperor. It's a little sad. I would rather like my friend, my good friend, the Austrian Archduke, uh, Archduke Rainer von Habsburg, to be in charge. Ooh, that is a talented, talented rebel. What kind of rebel rebellion is that? Separatists, Tyrone separatists. That is. Probably gonna break them. I like to Scotland. Scotland and Ulster. Portugal's been able to hold on to Cantor and have been forced to return to Fulu. Okay. And I'm gonna keep a diplomat in France forever and ever. Disloyal. They will not help, offer much help in wars. Ugh. How close are we? We are six years out from the annexation of Gascony. Oh, that will be a good. That will be a good thing. Futu Jalon, I've returned to Kabu. I want to know what's going on down here. It's a great mystery. How's my diplomatic reputation going, anyways, right now? All right, they're not bad. Legitimate. We got Daniel Gray. Hmm. Huh. That's odd. But these guys. This single individual tiny province. Had a spy network in England. I know. I'm baffled too. Little advisor. Lose prestige. Daniel Gray for removed from court. No. We have faith in them. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, it doesn't actually... There's no actual cost for this, for being ahead of time. So, you know what? We'll take it. Bloop. Another group of ideas. Okay, well, let's let's consider. Let's consider our options. Military. It springs always immediately to mind. And yet... And yet... Uh, cash. Always valuable. Economic is always a big deal for me, I find. Administrative, though. Cheaper core creation. Lots of mercenaries. Mm. That's all it really does. More states. Mm. And, and economic just helps you also keep your places loyal. By reducing autonomy. Well, not loyal, but uh, I guess kind of loyal works. So perhaps, perhaps it's a matter of um, we should be looking to building up an offensive war. Faster recruitment, better generals, better siege, better discipline, better morale recovery. Hmm. I'm, I'm honestly not sure. I tend to take defensive, right? Defense, you get better. Your tra army tradition. Better morale. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah, right. You got the risk of trade. Oh, I would get mercantilism. I want mercantilism. I will go into debt, but I'm going to compensate the traders. Oh, my, my, my income. <laughs> All right, we took a loan. Damn it. And things have been going so well. 
Uh, yeah, cheaper armies, better forts, faster reinforcement, less attrition, and more attrition for the enemy. Mm. Alright, let's consider my economy again. Obviously, the faster I can pay it back, the better. Also, at some point, a leader who could reduce that would be nice. But none are there. Obviously, uh, one of the other advantages, going back to administrative, more money means you can hire better leaders. Better leaders means more monarch points. Monarch points, of course, feeding, ideas, technology, um, absorbing kingdoms, taking land and coring it. Oh, well. But I just don't know right now. Plus, of course, all this that I'm working on. With getting that second idea. Still disloyal. How how disloyal are they? 52! Hmm. Hmm. So next year, probably. Now, let's see. What will happen next year? Uh, 10... 15-ish points will be added to their... To, to their opinion of us. The National Epic. Yearly prestige up. I will pass on the prestige. I gotta save my precious money. I have an economy to run. Uh, well, you know what? I'm afraid I'm gonna have to put a spy network in Portugal. Oh, yes, they don't like me for breaking that alliance. But I would like to steal their maps and know what's going on in the world. Requires diplomatic technology six. I believe I have that, and I have. I need my spy work be at size fifty. All right. Oh, I don't have that, do I? Hmm. Yeah. Well, it's something to work towards. Because mm. at this point, I'm sure Portugal's starting to explore since they've been doing off-map warfare. Hello, what are you? Florence. You know, Papal State hasn't done pretty, uh, very bad for itself, although it's, I, uh, their ability to expand is very quickly running out. Out of Austria and Siena, because you know, they're going to not be able to push too much. Oh, hello. Another war. Bohemia and Holt Brand. Who's who? What war is this? Attack against Bohemia in the Hungarian conquest of Breslau. Okay. Those bold, sexy Hungarians. Ah, it's a von Habsburg. Okay. Interesting. Stias mm -hmm. von Habsburg. Mm -hmm. The Papal... Pope answers only to God. Okay. I gain half a point every year. Ugh. Just, ugh. That's fine, though. I have claims on lots of provinces. Inverness. Yeah, but if I want to go to war with them... Oh, here we are. More than 50, they could become declared independence war. So, one more year? Oh, um... I want the diplomatic power. So... 
quest for the new world. I could recruit explorers and ex conquistadors of my own. Or do I save up the 100 points? You know what? You know what? I am. I am a man who likes my ideas. Bam! Quest for the new world. Let's join the number of nations to explore the world outside the borders. Or strive to be the first nation to circumnavigate the world by commencing a quest for the new world. All right. Now then. First things first. Repay a loan, which I will need three or four months to fix. Okay. And next year with France should solve their disloyalty issue. They'll be super uh, duper loyal. Mm. At least until they get more ideas or uh, whatnot. Mentor takes seven. Actually, let's take a look. What what have ideas did they take? They've got four ideas. See? See the advantages of a good ruler? Alright, Muscovy spies. Influence and economic ideas. Oh yeah, which means they've already got one of their... Um, one of their uh, special French uh, national ideas. Well, you have two ideas. So their bonus is more diplomatic relations, better diplomatic reputation, and more people. Just people out the wazoo. Also. Bam! Repaid by loans. Alright, well... You, just so I have it available... Well, actually. I do plan to start by the... Ah, oh, we'll wait. We'll wait. Oh, an advisor died. Who died? My military advisor. I'll need a new one. This Timothy Robson, born in Cumbria, making him a Cumbrian. Yeah, we'll hire him. Just gotta wait a little. Hello. Are we ahead at all? Ahead of time, by one year. So I'll wait. Then we'll get Pike and Shot. And there we are. They're hostile to us. Oh no, it's Brittany. <laughs> There's France. Now they're still disloyal. Hmm. Mm. P of England minus nine. Built of power, etc. etc. Okay. Well, let's take a... Uh, let's start a new debate. There's more war in Ireland. Cheaper advisors. More diplomats. Cheaper building. Less land maintenance. I'll take the, the base tax, I think. Mm. I'll lose the army commission. I'll spend my papal influence. Yay! Base tack in uh, Oxfordshire. I was apparently told that's how you should pronounce it. Oxfordshire. Mm. Bam! Better guy. Uh, Henry, you're just terrible. Well, at least, at least soon, we'll be able to enjoy the fruits of ruling Gas uh, of the Gascony region being all in our hands. He's been doing it for 5,000 days. Daniel Marlborough. I admire his dedication. Yeah, I don't know any current missions. I know, I know. It's a waiting game. I know. But soon. Soon. It'll all change. This Gascony becomes mine. Their their money directly funneled into my coffers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's 
speaking of, can I do anything? Could I do anything with them? Mm. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna enable scutage. They'll pay me more cash. They no longer be called to my wars. Good. I don't plan to bring them into any wars at the moment, and they are almost completely absorbed. Yes. So I think we can definitely leave that as it is. Just get a little more cash out of them. Something we desperately need. Ah, oh, Portugal caught us! Awkward. But, whatever. Them's the breaks. Ah, oh, they finally got an army together to attack the rebels. And... The rebels of Breno Flanagan kicking their arse. And it was lost. That's gonna hurt your chances of keeping control of that territory, buddy. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, it's a new year, which means I don't think we're ahead any time. Nope. Pike and shot. So, the Archibus was easy to use as a weapon, but it's also accurate and slow to fire. It's vulnerable to cavalry charges. Oh. Uh, oh, I don't want to lose money. I don't want to lose stability. You know what? Executing troublemakers. Anyhow. Uh, blending with pikemen allowed Archibusers to fire and then fall back to be shielded. Better infantry in the next point. Oh well. Oh, it's so close. And they're disloyal again. That's fine. Once. Mm. Once we get Gascony properly absorbed, they will become loyal. Still disloyal. Well, that's fine. I'm not an I'm not an aggressive overlord just because I waged two horribly terrible wars of conquest on you. I mean, come on, France. May, less than a year to go. Perfect. Five each month. Base two. Same religion. One. Diplomatic rep plus two. Perfect. That's a good thing. I had that one guy. Stretch that out a whole lot longer. And yeah, that would have been awkward. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling Muscovy is going to be coming. will turn into Russia. This game. Let's see, what's this? Muscovite Purge of Danish Heresy. Ooh, curious. Oh, look, the Danes took over some Baltic land. Curiouser. They must have invaded Novgorod at some point. Hmm. Yeah, at some point, a war with Denmark to force them to release Norway and Sweden would be good. Would be very good. Hmm. Oh, Morocco. Oh, well done, Portugal. You're doing better this time. Ah, Castile's on your side. Continue the Reconquista. Alright. Good luck, Castile. What, what are you up to, buddy? Cocker Tangiers. Okay, fair enough. Aragon's not up to anything. Gascon's not up to Brittany, nothing. Nope, no mission anymore. Austria, got up to anything? No. So I was curious, you can kind of find out what people are up to sometimes. Cocker Ozzel. Alright. Mm -hmm. Win uh, what's this? Window on the West. I kind of wish I knew what that did, honestly. Recovered Danzig. Uh, Teutonic Order allied with Hungary and the Livonian Order. Mm, makes it chancy that you'll be able to pull it off. 
Ottomans want to conquer Kaffa. Okay. Oh, Genoa. Trade trouble in Tunis. Mm -hmm. Jazz. Okay, so we have a, we have a little bit of an idea of what's kind of going on in the world. I mean, these guys are trying to unify, even as they stab each other in the face. Ah, uh, there we are. We did it. We integrated Gascony. Slow process. Hurts our diplomatic reputation. Perfect. I have to take a loan, though. We gained... Oh, I could take a war against uh, Aragon, because they've been excommunicated. Hmm, what's this? I can make states. Okay. There is a to several territories where all provinces own its area make up one territory. To say the nation, which is an integral part of the realm. Cost some nation depending on the district of the capital while reducing its minimum autonomy dramatically. Okay. Hmm. Territories can now autonomy lower than 75%. Alright then. So uh, a lot of penalties to my to my, my 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 goods. Let's take a look at their ships first of all. I'm gonna disband that. What do I got here? Four eight ooh, that's, you know that's that's a decent army. Mm, however, Mothball those forts, please. Uh, it seems my economic situation is not as good as I had hoped it would become. Which is a bit upsetting. Alright, what do we got? 30? I'm spending 30 on my army. Alright, well, we're gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. Okay, let's take half of you, I'm afraid. Funk. Still not doing it. Um, I'm gonna sh take away one of your castles. Look, mm, looks a little. Ah, money. The plus side. Oh, they're still disloyal though. See, why are you disloyal now? English. Oh, it's my. Okay, it's my. Better tech. Lots of power. Hmm. Alright, well, we're gonna take a little break here. We're gonna see what we can do to uh, calm French opinion next time. Thank you all for watching, and I'll, uh, I will see you soon.